Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Minecraft Let's Play. This is Season 6, Feed the Beast, Part 24. And as you can see, i got some s stuff going on in here. I've done a bunch of research, well, a good amount of research. I've researched uh, all of these um, transmutations. I don't know what those are good for. I've researched <clears throat> al Alimentium, which uh, I think is just... I'm not sure what that is, I'll mess around with that later. I've also researched Basic Alchemy. And I've researched thomium, which is like a metal. And then I've researched magical building blocks. That's that's what I need to craft the big table I'm going to craft over here. So, uh, without further ado, I need to make more thomium ingots. Actually, I only need one more, which is pretty weird. but Because I must have got some in a, in a... I don't know, somewhere. Alright, so I need eight metal and four... Eight metalum and four... Of the magic stuff. Uh, I'm not going to try and pronounce those names. So, 8 metal, 4 magic. Let's, uh, got water in there. It looks like it's, uh, okay. Yeah, it's boiling. So, 8 metal. So, iron ingots have just metal. So, we're going to go with, um, 8 of those. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And the magic, I've decided to go with viz shards. Uh, that has, actually, oh. Uh, one piece of iron has eight, eight, eight uh, of the metal on it or whatever, and the viz shard has six magic. And we only need four, so that's it. Uh, I think that's it. Uh, let me see. Where's my wand? Oh yeah, the wand's in here. There we go. Is that one? Yep. Give me one. Alright, cool. First of all, I want to dump a bunch of this stuff off in here. Uh, what else? This stuff. This stuff. I don't know what these Cortez crystals are for. I guess I should look those up. Uh, right here, I had a bunch of extra research notes because I didn't know what I was doing. So, <laughs> you know, what are you going to do? Alright, so let's craft this bad boy up. We've got to put the wand right there. Then we put these like that and we have stone and there we go eight eight blocks so now we can break this up and place this down in a two by two and then put a wand on it and that's like our uh, giant it's like a multi-block structure thing and there we go all right now we're cruising along um I'm not sure what the next step is. Let me see what I got here. Uh, yeah, it looks like I got some more research to do. So I'm going to do some more research, and I'll be back when I'm done. And I'm back. And I've done something I've never done before uh, in this game. I uh, I didn't finish that video last night. I actually had to go to bed. So uh, this is actually a different day, but same video. It's kind of weird. Um, I have a lot of plans here. First of all, I'm going to try and get rid of this lag somehow. Uh, I have a couple things I want to do here. Uh, number one priority is to finish, uh, to show you what I've, uh, what I've researched with the magic. Uh, so let's go to sleep and make a day. I'm going to go show you what I've researched. I've researched a bunch of things. Um, not too many of them really get me excited, except for a couple wands. Uh, the one wand I got is the Wand of Excavation, which is pretty cool. It's like, uh, it's basically a wand that you can use to do the same thing your mining tools do, except it goes farther. You know, it's limited uses or usefulness, but you know, I'm gonna make it just for the just for the hell of it. So let's check it out in my thought by the way, you can see I have a lot of stuff in here in my bags. Don't worry, it's not a mess. They actually all mean something and I got plans. So first of all, let's look in my Thaumonomicron here. I've research I think I left off researching magical building blocks. I've since researched it uh, enhanced fabric, thauma whatever robes uh, those are some you know wizard robes I'm not gonna make um, this is a thermometer this is uh, a magical detector but it kind of like I think you can make glasses out of it but I'm not sure if I have to make it first I'm gonna look into that a little bit more uh, how do I get back escape yeah okay uh, I've also got basic artifact artificing um, yeah that's that's basic like 
you know, stuff that basically lets you go to the next step. Then I got Unified Thomic Field Theory. This is basically like uh, Tier 2. And here are the wands. I didn't get any, any of these three wands, but I did get the Wand of Excavation and the Wand of Equal Trade. And the Wand of Equal Trade is really nice. It kind of does the same thing that the Philosopher's Stone did in uh, Equivalent Exchange 2. It lets you like change blocks of a certain type to blocks of another certain type, as long as they're of equal value. And we also have the Wand of Excavation. I'm going to make the Wand of Excavation. Um... Okay, a wand of apprentice. Okay, so uh, three earth shards like that, and then a wand of apprentice, and I gotta give it some of this stuff. We'll uh, put that stuff together first. I've moved everything over here, so I also went mining recently, so that's pretty cool. Alright, so the wand is. How do I do this? I guess like this. Yep. Okay, and I need uh, four of these, like hammer things. I'm not even going to try and say these words because I can't. Uh, and then 16 metalum. The metalum's easy. That's just iron. Uh, actually, it's only two pieces of iron. Uh, this one's a little bit tougher, uh, and I don't have my cheat sheet with me, so I'm going to have to kind of stumble through this. Let's see. I know we have some things in here that have it. Yep. Alright. My pickaxes have it, but they also have a lot of other crap um, that I'm going to be putting into the environment, but I don't know of anything else that has it without my cheat sheet. Uh, so, yeah. Huh. Yeah, it looks like I'm kind of going to have to bite the bullet on this one. Alright, how many do I need? I think I only need four, right? First of all, let's put some water in there. I always want to have full buckets of water with me, so let's put the water in there. And fill up our buckets. Fill this up again. It takes a little bit to warm up. So let's put our buckets away. Okay. And yeah, only four of those. I don't know what else has them. Nothing I can see on me has them. Uh, ooh, there we go. Flint. So for four flint, I'll, I'll throw four stone into the environment. And if I do a pickaxe, I'll be throwing two stone, two of the tree thing, and two of the other things. So, yeah, the flint's actually a good trade for that. All right. Good, good deal. So, one, two, three, four. So, four of those, and two iron. And that should be all we need. So, let's go ahead and throw that stuff in there. And I think we come over here and... It's supposed to be flying over to it. Uh, do I need a wand in there? Yeah, I think I need a wand in there. Hmm, what am I doing wrong here? I think I need another wand. Let's go ahead and make another wand really quick. Actually, hold on. See what else is it? Let's see what else this says. Wand of Apprentice, and we get the wand of, and cost 50 V's. So yeah, I think because we put the wand in there, I think we need another wand. So let's go ahead and make another. Actually, I think I can make a different wand. Whoa, what's going on? Huh, hold on. I think I can make a different. I could have swore I had a chance to make another wand. Yeah, I can make. Wait, another wand? Oh, I can make the wand of the adept. But we've already put that stuff in there. Alright, we're just going to waste some resources and make another Wand of the Apprentice. Uh, I think we kind of screwed up, though. I'm going to make some more gold nuggets. Uh, put that right there. Put the Earth Shard. And there we go. Yeah, I think we kind of messed up. When you put the Wand in, in this thing, it, it, it gains Vs at a slower rate, so I'm going to keep it in my inventory for now. Yeah. Okay, so let's wait for that. All right. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna. I'm basically gonna end up wasting a wand, which the only thing that really matters about it is the earth shard I'm gonna use on it. Basically, what you would have done was make the upgraded wand and then put that in here and use this wand of the apprentice to make some make your new wand. I guess if that makes any sense. Actually, I probably need the wand of the apprentice for the wand of equal trade as well. Yeah. So I actually I didn't waste any anything doing it. Alright, so that should be 50. Put that in there, and there we go. 
and it released some stuff into the into the ether, whatever you want to call it, but who cares, because I'm a magic guy. So, here we go, Wand of Excavation. There you go. And what this is good for, but cutting down trees, is when the trees are too high. And you can see it, the V's in it, uh, or the durability. I'm not sure if that's durability or what. It's probably durability, now that I think about it. But I, I'm not really sure. I'll probably just use these for trees from now on. I really have no need for axes. Yep. So right here you can like get this stuff. Look at how far that goes. Look at that. That's freaking far as hell. Autumn's gonna love this because she she likes all the magic stuff. All right, enough playing around with that. That's the wand of excavation. Pretty sweet. Um, again, I really wish I could name these bags, because I would have, like, a bag for magical items, you know? Uh, so, but for now, it's just gonna have to go in this bag. I'm running out of room in that bag, too. Alright, whatever. Let's get going. Alright. That's gonna be all the magic I'm gonna do for a little while. Uh, you know, um... Thomcraft is pretty cool, but I can't be doing it all the time. I gotta finish that building too. I gotta finish the walkway, but I'll I'll do that off camera. All right. I have two things that I have to get going with. First of all, I want to make a sorting system. Uh, it's not gonna be a fully fledged sorting system because there's just too much stuff to sort. Like I'm not gonna be able to sort like everything in this chest. Like all the pipes and the the engines. This will not be a sortable chest. Uh, this will probably be a sortable chest. Uh, one, two... I think I could have as much as nine things in each chest with my sorting system set up the way it, it's going to be. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nah, actually I'm going to need two. I'm going to have to think about how I want to do it. But, uh, basically, uh, I'm not going to be sorting this chest. And I probably won't sort my miscellaneous chest. That'll just be miscellaneous stuff. And I probably won't sort the foliage chest. That's a lot of crap. Or the bees chest, because that's Autumn's thing. So, anyway, bottom line is I need a sorting system, and I need to... I'm going to be using the alloy furnace pretty heavily, um, but because I'm going to be using the alloy furnace pretty heavily, I don't want to use that alloy furnace. I want to use this one. So let's pick this up and put this one down. Uh, now we're going to need to power it. Uh, the first thing I'm going to want to do to power this thing is a battery box. So let's see what we need. For that, uh, yeah, we're gonna need the batteries. So uh, it's copper, tin, and nickelite. Uh, four of them. Uh, copper. I didn't see where it was. Uh, copper, tin, and nickelite. Hold on, I know I got it here somewhere. Copper. There's my copper. All right, now how did that go again? Copper, tin, and nickelite. Got it. And I think I said four of these. It's backwards, isn't it? There we go. One, two, three, four. All right, let's see what else we need for the battery box. We're going to need uh, a blue alloy ingot. I believe we have one of those. And iron. I think we have a blue alloy ingot somewhere. Blue alloy ingot. Huh, I could have swore I had one. It doesn't seem like... It. Oh, no, you know what? I had a red uh, alloy ingot. Okay, that's fair enough. So we got to make the blue alloy ingot, so... We're going to have to put that thing back down. Um, okay, blue alloy ingot is... three One silver, three nickelite. Um, silver, silver, silver... One silver, and we'll grab our nickelite. One silver, three, what did I say, four nickelite? Ah, oh, whatever. We'll see. Actually, we got to put the other one back down anyway. Temporary, very temporary. One, two, three, four. Silver. We use wood, not wasting coal on this. Actually, using unprocessed, uh, using the birch would unprocessed probably waste. Well, not really, it's going down pretty quick. All right. So now that we have that, we can make the iron. 
Well, take the iron. Uh, where is it? Like that. Like that. What goes on top? I don't remember. Oh, yeah. Piece of wood. Um. Do this. One piece of wood. Now we have a battery box. Now, the battery box is exactly what it sounds like. It, it'll take the charge from our solar panels and just store it until it's time to be used. I'm going to put that right next to the right next to the blue trick alloy furnace. Now we need, uh, to get us started, I guess, one solar panel, uh, an alloy. Let's make the wire first. We're going to need quite a bit of this. So we need the blue alloy ingots, which is oh, more silver and nickelite. Okay. Uh, let's get more silver. Where do we put the rest of our silver? There we go. Right, I'm just going to throw a bunch of this in there. Where's that coal? I know I have a lot of coal. I've been mining like a madman the past couple days. Uh, there. And... Uh, six. Actually, we're going to need more than... Well, yeah, we're going to need a lot more than six. That means we're going to need more nickelite as well. I'm starting to go through a nickelite. I stopped mining nickelite quite a while ago. So, I guess I'm going to have to start mining it again. Alright, well that's doing its thing. Let me work on my inventory here a little bit. Put the wood away. Dirt. Cowl. Oh, full of dirt. Alright, I'm pretty sure we need just about everything else. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Put the Thaumonomicron away. What do I say? Cron. Thaumonomicron? You say cron. Uh, it's con. Okay, whatever, man. Get over it. Jesus. No. I can call what I want. It's my freaking no. video. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. Yes, Watch me. No. No, I won't. Oh, you will. Unsub, 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 unsub. <laughs> anyway. Okay, uh... How many do I get for each one? Uh, 12 for each one, so... We'll wait for nine. One more! Alright. Uh, what do I do with my... There we go, got a bunch of wool. I had to go do a bunch of flaxseed farming to uh, get a bunch of string for wool. It's much better than hunting down stupid sheep. There we go, 36, that'll be plenty. This is going to go up to my roof. Alright, so now we need the solar panels. Solar panels. Alright, so we're going to need the blue dope wafer, another blue alloy ingot, which probably should have waited for that. Alright, so let's do the coal and sand. Alright, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to cook myself up. You can see silver and nickelate in the alloy furnace, and coal and sand in the alloy furnace. I'm going to cook all this up, and then I will come back. Actually, you know what? Never mind. i got a minute and 30 seconds left. I might as well just blab on through it. Um... Yeah, like I said, I've been doing a lot of mining because the coal. Like I stopped mining coal too because I just wasn't using. I wasn't like using a lot of it. Actually, you know we could put these up together. Silver. I only need one of those, right? Yeah. We can make a few. Probably should make a few. We're gonna need a few anyway. I uh, I don't know how many I'm gonna need, but I, I don't think one's gonna be enough. Uh, five is probably too many. Four will be good. It's weird. It's cooking the silver and nickelite first. I didn't... I don't know how it decides which one to cook first. But... Okay... And there we go. I'm going to... Coming up to the end of the video, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm going to cook up the uh, coal in the sand uh, into the silicon bowl, boule. I don't know, I've heard it called both things. 
Uh, then I'm going to cut that up and I'm going to use that to cook with with Nicolite into blue doped wafers into, I guess, 8, eight times 4, 32 blue doped wafers. So uh, I'll have that ready for next video and that's going to be it for part 24 and we'll see you next time for part 25. Till then, take it easy.